Elden Ring Master. Enjoy this last. Hey, hello, welcome back to another session. So this time we're taking down the final boss, Elden Beast. And this is the setup we're going to be using. So Falling Star Beast Joe plus 10. Blood of Comedian Seal plus 10. Uh, the protection against Holy Talisman plus 2. These are the main items. And this Talisman can help us really get uh, very low damage from the Holy attacks we're gonna be dealt. And the rest is just spamming the special attack on the weapon. And that's it. Avoid as much as the attacks. I'm not gonna unbuff myself with Golden Bow, Flame, Give Me Strength, Just with Vitality, and uh, Bless of Boom. Okay. So we're gonna skip the cutscene. We're going straight to the fight. Okay, so first by the down of the Golden Order, so you wanna directly once you invoke uh black knife pitch you wanna move away because you don't wanna be hit and you're gonna recharge the mana flask and then uh, once the aggro towards uh, black knife we're going to spam the special attack a few times not more than two or three times in a row depending on the opening because you can get very aggressive very quickly and as you can see I'm not doing any effort really to, uh, to avoid damage the attacks because the damage is pretty much reduced not being one shot, uh, I have the talisman and I'm also wearing all the armor I can that have the most uh, all the damage negation. And you haven't seen that in the, in the good presentation in the game. So once we get to the Elven Beast, pretty much the same strategy, try to avoid as much as we can the attacks and spam the, the special attack on the weapon. So when you have those circle things, you want to try to roll through the beams, but it's, all, it's not that simple, so do what I did, just make sure you have the most holy damage negation equipment as possible, and then don't worry about it, just restore your health. The goal is really to kill the boss and not to learn how to avoid the attacks. There are different ways to defeat the boss, you can learn how to avoid the attacks, or you can simply go for the kill and use the, the, the needed equipment and then just go damage uh, until you defeat the boss's health. And if you reach this far, obviously you have a lot of items, so you probably didn't shuffle and try to get the best combination. At that point, that's what you want to do. So I'm happy Black Knight is still alive. At that point, that means we're in a good position. Uh, um, I think that's uh, pretty obvious we cannot take the other piece down. That was like my third run. Uh, and the first time I faced uh, the Elder Beast, that's my first game through. So wasn't that bad compared to the bosses. Obviously I'm cheating as well, so yeah, that's it. So we got the membranes. You can exchange it for the sword that does like the golden waves. You've seen some YouTube videos on it, like people farming a lot of rooms using the sword. You can now use it. And I'm going to show you uh, my ending. So since I've done Rani's uh, quest, she's going to appear here and you can summon her and we're going to opt for this ending as our first uh, as our first ending. So I'll leave you to the it. battle is uh, over. If you I see. Enjoyed the video, please do subscribe, hit a few likes, share, and subscribe to the channel to get a lot of more uh, Elden Ring content and uh, weapon testing, armor testing, different combinations, secret loot, secret quests and so on. Okay.
I do solemnly swear to every living being and every living soul. Now cometh the age of the stars. A thousand year voyage under the wisdom of the moon. Here beginneth the chill night that encompasses all, reaching the great beyond. into fear, doubt, and loneliness, as the path stretcheth into darkness. Well then, shall we? My fair consort eternal. <laughs>